if you don't have iTunes, it's a free download from Apple. Um, and here's the address. You click on free download. You want to uncheck these or you'll get a lot of emails and then you just click download now and then you'll click save and it will download to, to either your desktop or your downloads folder. This is how you'll just run the setup file from iTunes. It may take a while. Once um, I've downloaded and installed iTunes, I will open it and then I'm going to go up here, I'm going to go to a list instead of the icons and then I'm going to click over here on podcasts and right now we're not subscribed to anything. So the next step would be if you go to your Tegrity class in the upper right you'll see an icon for iTunes. So I click on this and then I'll get um, an option to subscribe to a class. Now I'm going to make sure I have the right one chosen because I'm in several classes and then I want to subscribe to video podcast. That way I always get the video along with the audio and then I have to allow it. My computer's asking me this. Now if you'll see um, I'm under podcast and I'm going to go back here and I'm going to look at it this way. In iTunes, if you go over here, make sure you have podcast chosen. You'll see my Bowdoin's Demo Course 1, and it did download the most recent one, but I can always go back and download the next one. As you'll see, it's downloading in the background. To play this, you just double click it, and you'll see that you can play it. And then you can click this little X, and it'll go away. The other thing that's really important to be aware of is settings. This is set up to check for new episodes every day, which is something you want, and that's the setting for this podcast, the series of podcasts, or this course, Integrity course. Sometimes when you go in here, this is checked. What you want to be aware of is episodes to keep. So if you uncheck this, you have the option. If you're um, losing your podcast after you're watching them, it probably is deleting um, after you play them. So you can always choose episodes to keep all episodes and click OK. And now they'll be kept even if you um, have finished watching them for later viewing.